Hello, and thanks for checking out ChartGuys.com. We're proud to be one of the most successful technical analysis communities online, teaching you the skills to become a more confident, effective, and informed trader. Join our community of hundreds of analysts worldwide working together to learn the charts, generate profit, and achieve financial independence. Sign up for a one-week free trial, no credit card required, for access to daily live chart analysis and market coverage, a thriving chat community, along with dozens of hours of exclusive educational materials. We look forward to seeing you. Let's check out some charts. Hey everyone, checking in on PCLN, NVDA, Tesla, Netflix, CMG on the daily weekly time frame. So PCLN got some follow through today with a higher low and a higher high. The resistance is 1800 psychological and it is a bit of an indecisive candlestick favoring the bears at the top of this bull move. If we lose the daily higher low pattern, which has been intact the last six days, that will be an indication that we are going to see some healthy consolidation and we will look for a higher low to form on that consolidation because we broke to a higher high. Moving average resistance is going to be dropping down towards that 1800 level. The weekly time frame now has the higher low and higher high, and the bulls are trying to close over these exponential resistances on the weekly to give some follow through into next week. NVDA rejecting just under the daily middle Bollinger Band. We also already have the higher low and higher high. Inside bar on the daily time frame, a break of 194.96 is bearish. A break of 197.73 is bullish. And we're looking for a higher low to be established on the daily time frame because we broke to a higher high. Bull MACD cross is ready to go. Need to close over the middle Bollinger Band resistance. The sooner the better. Inside bar on the weekly broke bullish. We're holding the middle Bollinger Band for the bulls over the past couple of weeks. As long as that holds, we are in the bullish upper Bollinger Band trading channel. And that is what we are looking at in terms of the level the bulls want to maintain to stay their strongest in the longer term uptrend while we recover from the dump that we saw at the end of November. Tesla dumping and breaking a key support as soon as we break 335.76, that's a clear bear signal because of the lack of support underneath it. We had a bull breakout two days in a row where we just ran straight up and didn't establish much support at all. That's why it was easy for the bears to fall back down once that low of consolidation broke. Increasing bear volume, close at the low of the day. There's a small gap here at 329.01 that we're looking to fill. And on the weekly time frame for Tesla, back under the middle Bollinger Band and heading back towards the 50-week support at this point. Hourly RSI on Tesla is already in the mid-20s, so if we see further downside early tomorrow morning, we're looking for a short-term bounce to happen not too long after that. Higher low pattern on the daily loss for Netflix today. Bear signal when 188.90 broke. 100-day moving average support holding for the third test in a row. That's at 185.85, and we need to see the bulls maintain that level and get back up into the upper or the lower 190s, I should say, because as of right now, Netflix is the furthest away from all-time highs in terms of the big five that we cover. And we're seeing consolidation now literally for the third month in a row. So we haven't pulled back significantly, but we haven't seen much bullish action. So watching very close for the bulls to show up, maybe a lagger play to the overall sector. But at this point, no sign of the bulls and not going to try and force anything. I'd rather play names in blue sky breakout than try and find Netflix momentum, which clearly it's struggling with. CMG had a bear break of the inside bar at 312.15. But the bulls bought the dip today, and we have this clear tightening channel with wicks depicting that range that's shrinking. High, low, lower, high, higher, low, and watching for a clear break right now. I'm looking at 308.21 support and 325.71 resistance. We've been trading within this channel all month, and there's no sign of any break at this point. Healthy consolidation on the weekly as long as the middle Bollinger Band holds on any back test, and the CMG bulls definitely trying to maintain that 305 low. Otherwise, we are falling back to an area with a lack of support. If we see a bull break, that will be significant in terms of shifting momentum on the weekly chart back to favoring the bulls. And that double top at 332 and 333 is the key level to be watching. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you tomorrow. Have a great night.